Okay, so now I'm in Cricut Design Space. As you see, the picture is the one I picked, the Snoopy. It's, uh, it's as a pattern, it's not as a, an image. I will show you how I created that one. So let's see. So I will make a new project. So if I go, so it's gonna be step by step what I did. So I select a new project. And because I'm doing sublimation, I will be using a project and I will be searching for mugs. Now when I go down till we get the uh, mug design, okay, any of them, right? Okay, so this is the mug design setup. We select that one and the mug the one I'm using is the Cricut 15 ounces. So, and I like the, the design for the revealed wavy edge. So you see how it's those wavy, I like that style. And then I click on customize. Now that's got us the template. So in here we can see, you know, how center it is on the, from both sides and in the middle. Now what I will do, I want to ungroup this one. So this way I can select just the gray area to be just the background. And then I will be uploading the picture, the one I want. So we go to upload. And then here, instead of upload an image, we want to upload a pattern. So we click upload pattern, browse, and here's the picture, the one I want, which is Snoopy. I click open, selected, upload. And just wait. <clears throat> okay, so it's already been uploaded, so we can hit cancel now. And now we select the area, the gray area where we want to be our pattern or for the image. And we go in here and we select print cut. We select the standard. Now we go to, to the color. Then instead of color, we select pattern. And now we should be able to see. See, we have two of them because I tested before. Okay, so, <clears throat> so here it is. So now we can get rid of everything. So everything is look center. We can get rid of this one. We select it, then we click on the eye on the right side to deselect it and the frame, the one on the back, we can. So this is the image, the one we want to print. Uh, for me, I have the 26, uh, 2760 Epson a printer. I made it as sublimation printer. So that's the one I would be using. And here it is. Now we, of course, this has to be mirrored. Don't forget that. And then we hit continue. And then we select the printer. This is, this is my printer and I don't need a bleed. We have it mirrored and now we send it to the printer. I think uh, I will speed up uh, the process while I'm trimming the paper and uh, wrapping up the mug and I will be back when the mug is ready. Okay, so now it's finished, so I will take it off uh, the mug press, and sure, it's very hot, so be careful, that's why I'm wearing uh, 
heat resistant to gloves and I cannot wait to see it by the way I uh, this is the first time I'm making this photo Snoopy and I love it so we'll see how it's gonna come out uh, cannot wait so let's see yeah just be careful it is hot wow oh my goodness wow that is beautiful look how it's matching wow I really love it did you? do you love it too? oh my god okay so this is the mug thank you for watching I hope you like it and you learned something from this video if you like it please give it a like and subscribe thank you and have a good day bye bye